Hey guys, it's KJ48. Welcome back to my Minecraft Let's Play. This is Season 6, Feed the Beast, and this is Part 32. And I've done a couple things here in between videos. Uh, first of all, I made three more of these redstone energy cells, and I am charging them as we speak. Uh, I, want all th I want all four of these to be charged so I can grab a couple and go out and do stuff that I want to do when I, when I need them. This thing's also doing stuff. I should probably turn this off because I'm going to be leaving here, so let me turn that off. Oh, let me make sure I'm not on peaceful. Nope. And let me make sure I'm not cheating. Make sure. Nope. Okay, good. Alright, I got a lot of things to, to craft today. Uh, they're all new items, so I decided I would craft them for you. So, let's go. First of all, I have a few different things I want to do. Actually, I actually have a lot of different things I want to be doing. And <laughs> it's getting to the point now where I've got a lot of stuff to do, and I can't decide what I want to do first, so I'm going to try and focus as best I can, but I have a lot of projects uh, on the table, and I'm going to, like I said, try and focus. The first thing we're going to do here is take three diamond blocks, uh, three blocks of iron, and four pieces of iron to make ourselves an anvil. Um, I'm assuming I can knock this up. Actually, there are different kinds of anvils. I, you know, I don't even know where I want to put this. I didn't even think about this. But anvil uh, helps you repair items, so I'll put it right there. All right, and the nice part about the anvil is I can take my fortune 2 pickaxe and I should be able to repair it. I think it takes iron. Um, no, maybe it takes sapphires because that's what I made with it. Yeah, that would make sense. Let's go get some sapphires. Um, I've never done this before, but um, it seems pretty cool. So, and it will cost me experience as well. Ooh, 27? Maybe that's because it's so damaged. I guess it takes the fact that it's almost broken and said, well, it's going to cost you 27 levels. Ah, uh, that sucks. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, it's because I can I can fix it less. If I was going to fix it all the way, it would take 24, 27. That doesn't make any sense. I can also rename it. So I'll name this my awesome... Pickaxe. Uh, okay, let's just uh, do what we can then. Oh, it costs... Uh, never mind. It costs uh, experience to rename it as well. So we'll just fix it twice. Take our 21 levels. Eh, it's okay. It's pretty cool, I guess. Uh, I want to keep this fortune because if I go to, uh, you know, enchant another one... See, the thing is, if I go to enchant another one, what are the chances I'm going to get fortune 3? But I really need those experience levels. I gotta figure out some good ways to level. And no no stupid farms where I don't have to like do anything. I mean like I wanna figure out a cool way to level. Um, you know what's been leveling me the most recently has been mining. It's been a, a really good way to level. Alright, whatever. Back to what we're doing. So one thing we let's see what we're gonna need here the most. Okay, a so yeah. We wanna make an assembly table. Okay, so we're gonna need diamond gears, that's gold surrounded by diamond stone. All right, so we gotta do the, we gotta make some ourselves some diamond gears. So that's easy. Stone goes to iron. Iron surrounded by gold goes to gold, and gold surrounded by diamond goes to diamond. Okay, so now we got the diamond gear, and <laughs> that's it. We got everything else we need. Um, got the obsidian right here. I think it was redstone, right? Diamond gear. What was in the top? Oh, redstone was in the top. Diamond was in the middle. It's weird that it takes a diamond and a diamond gear. Alright, so now we have an assembly table. And the assembly table is going to allow me to make something I've been needing for a long time, which is lot, which is uh, gates. I think they're called logic gates. I'm not sure. Uh, this is the setup right here I'm going to be using. The gate is... The assembly table is going to go right there. Now, in order to assemble stuff, you need these nice things. Lasers. I'm going to need a lot of these. All right. Redstone, diamond, and obsidian. We're going to need one, two, three, four, five. I'm thinking like five just to start off, and I can always expand later if I need to. So let's go with five lasers. All right. So we need the diamonds. By the way, my frames per second have been good in this game, and for some reason, I just feel laggy. Um, I'm thinking the animals outside... My door might have something to do with that, so I'm gonna I'm gonna be moving the farm as well. I was gonna be moving the farm anyway, but uh, 
it's just another reason to. Uh, how do I build this? I don't remember. Oh, okay. There. There. One, two, three, four, five. I don't want to screw anything up with this because this is really brand new to me. Uh, let's sleep and make it day. And we will put down the lasers. I should be able to repair this sapphire sword I have too. Although, what's the, what's the point of it? I mean, like, does it cost me levels to repair a regular sapphire item? Let's see. Take one sapphire. Yeah. It takes enchantment cost to, to name a sword. And it takes enchantment cost to repair a sword. Come on, man. Really? Hmm. I don't know about that. Okay, uh, back to what I was doing. i put down the lasers. It's daytime out. So the lasers have to... I think they have to be within four blocks of the table. So pretty much anywhere I put them in here is going to be pretty good. Um... I'm going to need some blocks here to place these correctly. Put that right there. Put that right there. Nope. Uh, put that right there. Yeah. I don't know if it matters which way it's facing or if I can use a wrench. I'd like it to all face the same way. Uh, I don't know if you could use a wrench to turn it. Or even if you need to turn it. You probably don't. Uh, nah. Uh, let's try and get it facing a cool way, though. Why is it facing that way? Eh, oh, well. It doesn't really matter. Alright, so let's put up some more cobble, and we will place these. For every laser you place, the, um, the process will go faster. So, that should work. Uh, so let's go outside and hook these up. We need our... We're gonna need our... Redstone energy conduit, and we're probably gonna need a lot more. All right, let's let's make some more of these. Uh, what did I need for these? Um, I forget how to make them. Uh, these. Oh yeah, the hardened glass and electrum stuff. Should have some in here. Oh, I think I put it all back here. Well, I, I know I got plenty of hardened glass. Um, although I'm not seeing it. Is it in my bag? Probably my bag. I think I need it for another recipe as well. I should take it all. Ooh, we're gonna need a lot more Electrum. Do I have any more? Oh, crap. Alright, um... Alright, I'm gonna make some more Electrum, because we're gonna need it. That is called Electrum, right? Yeah, I'm gonna make some more Electrum ingots, because we need it, and uh, when I'm done, I'll be back. Okay, I'm back. And, um, oh. Being attacked by a wisp. That's not good. I'm not sure what the best way to fight a wisp is yet. Um, I should probably do some research on that. I I heard you could you can hit him with a bow and arrow, but <clears throat> excuse me. But when I tried, I couldn't hit him. So I don't know. I don't know what the deal is. This is gonna be a problem. Dude, if you're going to run away, then just get the hell out of here. Well, anyway, I'll show you what I've hooked up here. Uh, first of all, I'm going to turn this distance back on the far. Because honestly, turning it on a, turning it down really doesn't help that much anyway. Um, I cooked up a bunch of that stuff. I made a bunch more pipes. And let's go downstairs and show you what I've done. All right, it comes up down... It comes up from the down from the roof you can see it right there comes underneath underneath here and connects up to here should be working uh ooh, hold on is that all right that that was drained a little but well, it was drained because of that i'm not sure if it's hooked up properly i don't know if i've done it right but i'm gonna try and make a gate and and you know we'll find out uh i know the one's not hooked up yet but th that's okay it's not really a big deal let's look up gates uh, I know I have to start off with a basic gate, so that's redstone. Uh, so, let's see. I know I probably have some redstone in my bags, but I'm going to grab some more. And let's see, we, let's see how this works. Alright, so I, I don't... I haven't done this, but let's see. Oh, there we go. 
and as the as the colors change they heat up and blue is working at max efficiency i'll hook this one up as well uh and there you go and that's how you make uh you make a chipset and that's how you make gates so let me knock this cobblestone out of here knock this out clean up a little bit let's hook that one up i'll i'll hook that one up for you guys show you show you how i do it not that there's really anything to it but you know We'll hook up that last one, and then we can start making gates, which will be good. Which means we won't have to uh, babysit our uh, we won't have to babysit our machines quite as much. Um, I don't really mind doing it too much, but the one in the Nether is what really bothers me. I hate having to go to the Nether all the time. All right, so this one needs to yeah, this can go right. Hold on a sec. Let me, let me just make myself a little platform. And it's got to go right there. Right? I want to see and make sure. Yeah, that's where it's got to go. Boom. Um, crap. Of course I don't have enough. And I'm going to really get on my nerves in this world. They're like, they seem to be aggro with me like all the time. Like, I don't even have to do anything and they're just like all over my, all, all over my face, you know? All right, we gotta make some more of these. Um, I should have some in here. Ooh, I got a lot of electrum. Good. All right, eight more should be good. Oh, 64. Ah, oh, fuck. I did not want to make 64 of that. I gotta stop holding down shift when I freaking craft. Um, all right, whatever. Nothing we can do about it now. Let's get another stack of redstone and put it in the magma crucible. Alright, there we go. And that'll be all what we're gonna need. Oh, what a pain. I can't believe I just wasted all that stuff. That stuff's gold, you know? Like, I don't mean it's gold. I mean, but I use gold to craft it, so I just wasted a good amount of gold. Um, I mean, I don't know. I might need this stuff more in the future, but... There we go. I don't know what happened on my chickens, dude. I slaughtered all the chickens except for the the babies. And when I came back, the babies were all gone. So maybe, I don't know, when they slaughter their parents, they can't live without them or something. I, I don't know, but it kind of sucks. Oh, yeah, we got to put a chest next to that thing. So this stuff has somewhere to go. So it just doesn't fall on the floor like that did. I don't think we have any made. No. We're low on wood, too. We should probably have to go ahead. I've got some plans to make an automatic lake tree farm type thing, uh, but I need to do take, take care of some other stuff first. As a matter of fact, that's going to be my next project. Uh, maybe I should mess around the gates. I don't know. Just put this behind it. Put it in behind it. Yeah, right, we make with this, and we make a gate. And there we go. Pretty cool, huh? I like it. So, as you can see, it's got the little progress bar there. Could always add more lasers. Um, meh. I don't. Ooh, why is that one green? Is it drawing more power than I can put out? Green. They should all be blue, so they're working at max efficiency. I don't know why that one would be green. It's kind of weird. Yeah, that's actually losing power, which makes sense. Oh, maybe because this thing's only output at 15 Minecraft joules per tick. But let's leave it at 50. Now let's see if that laser goes green on us. They should all be blue now. I forgot. I had my thingies, uh, my redstone, I forget what those things are called. I had them set up to not output that much. Uh, okay, let's do another one of these. Oh, it did it automatically that time. Now it should be getting plenty of power, so they should all go blue and stay blue. Probably gonna need a few of these. I don't know how that works, but we'll let it do its thing. <clears throat> um, I'm gonna do some more... I'm not gonna mess around at the gates right now. Uh, between this video and next, I'm gonna do some, re some more research on them. 
Uh, yeah, it'll make one right after another. Cool. Let's see if we'll make him stacked. And I think I could put this in and even make another. Okay. Yeah, so I could um, mess around at the gates right now, but to tell you the truth, I kind of have an idea of the way they work, but I want to make sure I have an idea of the way they work, so I'm going to come back to them uh, at a later time. So the next thing we need to make is called a filler. This thing is really cool. This thing can do everything from, uh, you know, flatten an area that you're trying to build on to building houses for you. Not like intricate houses, like basically like boxes. It could do a lot of cool things for you. Uh, so I am going to make one of these. I'm also going to need, I think, four landmarks total. I'm going to make I'm going to make five five landmarks. So let's go ahead and make our five landmarks. Landmarks is how you like. Uh, like choose the area you're going to be filling or uh, leveling. I'm going to be leveling areas. So, um, like I was telling you before, uh, remember I leveled that area like I'm standing on right now? Well, that would have been a lot easier if, if I thought to do it this way, if I knew to do it this way. But what did I say, five or six? I'm going to go with six. The hell with it. Six landmarks. Nope. One more. Okay. Now for the filler, we need some gold gears. Uh, you saw me make those. Uh, we don't have any iron gears. So we're going to need two. Put those in the middle. Make the gold gears. One, two. I almost held down shift again. Not that that would have been that big of a deal, but still. Gotta get out of that habit. All right, we need a chest. Uh, I think I have a chest ready to go. And a crafting bench. Yes, I do. We also need some dandelion yellow and some ink sacks. So, put down the ink sacks. Got the chest, crafting table, dandelion yellow, that thingy, and the gold gears. And now we have a filler. Filler is really, really cool. Uh, but before I can do anything with it, I'm going to need some brick. Uh, I forget how many brick, and I'm going to need... So I'm just going to take a bunch of it. And I'm also going to need some glass. Uh, where did I end up putting the glass? Here we go. Alright. Uh, in order to operate this filler, we are going... What we're going to do is... We're going to grab uh, one of our little... Uh, Energy things. I gotta remember what they're called. Redstone energy something. Uh, yeah, basically the giant batteries downstairs. I'm gonna grab one of those. Um, you know what? I don't think I can take any of. I don't think I can take this one. I think I have to take one of these. They're all, you know, pretty full anyway. Actually, this one's the most full. So let's take this one. Remember, it doesn't lose its charge. So I'm now carrying around all that energy, and I'll clean this area. Actually. On a little side note, uh, well, let's see how much time I have left. Yeah, uh, I'm not gonna have enough time to mess around with the uh, filler today uh, on this video, anyway. So I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go over some plans that I have. Um, I am going to make a thing called an iron tank, which is basically a multi-block structure that it's kind of like one of these, except it's giant and it's really cool looking. And I'm gonna build it right here. I'm probably gonna I'm probably gonna redo this whole area. And I'm probably not going to do it on fraps. Or maybe I'll like kind of think of how I want to do it and then bring up fraps. But basically, I'm going to put the iron tank right here. Uh, these are going to... Actually, this filter is going to be pushed right up against this liquid transposer. And hopefully, you won't even see this because I could do that line underneath. Yeah, I'll be able to do those uh, pipes underneath. So you won't even see these pipes. This will be right... So you'll just see, see these three. And hopefully, you'll just see the tank. Maybe you'll see this thing going into the wall. Uh, and then I'm going to set up gates on this, although I will do that on Fraps. So I will definitely show you that. Um, yeah, so this is going to be one big iron tank of lava, and I'm just going to pump mad amounts of lava out of the out of the nether. And that's going to be that's going to be basically it for this area. I'll probably set up an area for redstone energy cells, maybe like eight of them, maybe ten, uh, right here. And I'm just debating on how much I want to do with this on Fraps because a lot of it might be, you know, uh, quite strenuous to you know to do on fraps um if that makes any sense but th those are my plans uh for down there just want to go over that with you i'm kind of 
kind of still working working the plans out in my brain as well. So, all right, guys, uh, my timer is about to go off, so that's going to be it for part 32, and I'll see you next time for part 33. Till then, take it easy.